Oh! Oh, it's the Count! It's Gramps! Princess! Oh, it's good to see you! Gramps? Well, what are you doing here? I received notice from Princess Maya and came right away. I'm so happy to see you are well. I see being out of the world has made you a true warrior, Princess. Your shoulders have broadened a bit. Is that supposed to be a compliment? Okay, please ba- Okay, please pack your bags, Princess. Your days out in the world are over. It is time for you to return to East Heaven. What? No way! Princess, you must come home. His Majesty, your father, wishes to see you dearly. That old geezer! To hell with him! He took away my right to the throne! You're wasting your time! I'm not going back and that's that! Princess, what has happened to you? Your Majesty has... I failed. Please forgive me. And I'm all over the place. Jeez, are you crazy? Are you trying to kill yourself? I cannot face His Majesty if you will not come home. I will return to East Heaven in a coffin. Farewell, Princess. Oh, oh fine. I'll go home. Really? You promise? Yeah, I'm just... I'm, screw it. Screw it. Dang it. Yeah. Thank you, Princess. I knew you would listen to me. This is so unfair. I saw Princess Maya moments ago, and she is already and she is all ready to go. We can depart right now if you wish. Are you ready, Princess? Eh, not yet. Not at all. I still have things to take care of. Please take your time. I'll be waiting. Yep, that's how you end it here. Oh, fudging hell. I still need to check off check up the docks. Oh, and I also need to go and check out with Klaus and Myra, too. Oops. Ooh. Stomach, behave. Ugh. Oh, it's the priest. I came here to pray for those who are departing. May God be with you on your trip. You may not notice, but he is always watching over you. If you ever return, please stop by the church. Already did return to the church. Where did... Where did that dude go? Holy... What the hell? Okay, this is just getting... Ah! I'm, this, this is driving me nuts. Hey. A ship bound for the city is stopping by here soon. It's gonna get busy. No more breaks for you. I wonder what kind of people are coming in next. I hope they don't fall in the water like the people last time. <laughs> yeah, you could blame Rod for that. I heard the Princess of East Heaven is gonna take... It's gonna take the ship. That's funny. I haven't seen anyone that looks like a princess around here. <laughs> are you taking the ship the ship to the city? If you are, don't miss it. The next ship won't be in until next week. Damn, yeah. Back in those days, ships take took forever. Open the door. Yeah, I I am going to go a long time for this bit. And also, I who knows if this will be the final, final video. Who knows? Hello, Myra. Hello, Klaus. It's great to see you, Mint. You've been through mo so much. I'm so bummed out. I was so close. The relic was within my sight, and I couldn't get it. But knowing you, you're not going to give up, right? Right? That's right. I'll find another relic someday and fulfill my dream. <laughs> I thought you'd say that. What are you going to do now? Are you still going to continue your research? Oh, don't even ask. I was going to quit my research after I saw that fortress in the sky. Like I told you, I became so scared knowing that the relic was, in, was there. Well, I've had some time to think things over, and I've decided to continue my research. I don't think I'll ever let it go. Good. I'm kind of relieved. Well, I'm not. It means he's going to work less, work less than ever now. What? Sorry, dear. But since we've had a new son, I'll try to work harder. New son? Oh, you mean Prima. We're going to look after him from now on. He's so adorable. I'm sure we'll, f he'll, we'll get along just fine. It's going to get lonely around here. Rue all left already, and it won't be long before you leave. Rod told me he's leaving too. Yeah, but I'm sure we'll keep bumping into each other. I'll probably run into Klaus at some Hitler looking for a relic. That would be something. I'd love to look for a relic with you again. 
If I get something new information on a relic, I'll let you know. Then we'll work... Then we'll... Then will you work with me again? Of course! Well, I guess this is goodbye for now. I had a lot of fun, Mint. Take care of yourself. Come by anytime, alright? <laughs> Thanks for everything! And off she goes. Now we can finally leave, and yes, this video... <laughs> yeah, of, of... This is quite... This would have been quite boring if I just made this into a separate video, because it's just talking, but then again, lots of talking had already happened. Can I even go and talk to Mia? The royal princess is staying at this hotel. Can I talk to you? My brother, Solon, is behind the counter today. It is good for us to switch duties now and then. Actually, I'm standing here so I can be close to Princess Maya. What? You are Princess Maya's sister? That's impossible! The princess will be ready shortly. Please wait for her in the lobby. And... yeah. Yeah, now we gotta talk to Gramps. Princess, are you ready to go? And let us depart! Oh, son of a... <laughs> oh no! Oh, this is gonna be so freaking stupid! Oh. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Very good, Princess. I will go upstairs and get Princess Maya. Oh man, this is. <laughs> I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm going home. Heck, if I get bored, I'll run away again! Oh man. Oh jeez, Mint. Well, are we going to see East Heaven? Oh! What's going on? Oh! Yeah, we're on the boat! Bye-bye, Corona! You gonna jump kick her from here? Shouldn't you be in bed? I'm okay now. Well! So ends the tale of a spunky girl. Oh, what a wonderful breeze. This is strange. You're finally going home. I'm sure Father will be very happy. I'm not looking forward to facing him. I'm sure he'll punish me one way or another. Don't worry. He'll probably just crack a smile and forgive you. He's really missed you. He hasn't been eating much since you left. Now he only eat only he eats about half of what he used to. Half? You mean he only eats five meals a day now? Yes. Lately, all he's been saying is that he's gonna... He's going to retire. Retire? That means you're gonna be ruling the kingdom soon. Oh, brother. Well, have fun filling dad's shoes. Actually, I want to talk to you about that. What is it? This experience has taught me a lot. It made me realize how powerless I am. I had depended too much on the Book of Cosmos. Now I must rule the kingdom without it. I must rule with only with my own powers. I don't know if I can. Hmm. My dear sister, I feel terrible asking you this, but I need your help. Let's work together to rule our kingdom. Oh. Cool rulership, eh? That's the last thing I expected to hear from you. Alright, I'll give you a hand. Really? I'm so happy to hear that. I'd said... I'd say we have roughly three years. Three years? Yeah, three... Three years to make our kingdom three times... No! Ten times more powerful! Wait... You're not thinking of... Yes, I am! We'll conquer the world! <laughs> oh, jeez. On second thought, I'll do fine on my own. What the heck?! What do you mean by what the heck? I'm being serious, and it... And all you're thinking about is world conquest, and just give me a moment. Eh, oh, boy. I knew it was a mistake. Why are you making such a big deal? What's the difference between ruling East Heaven and conquering the world? There's nothing. There, there's not 
that much difference. Oh, forget it. It's my fault. I was stupid for asking you. What was I thinking? Hey! You begged for my help, and you're gonna... You're gonna get it, all right? I'm gonna stomp your head if you don't start showing me some gratitude. What are you... Are you threatening me? My goodness, you're as mad as ever. When we get back, I'm gonna have you locked up. I hope you re remember how to swim, because I'm gonna throw you overboard when I'm done with you. <laughs> I hope you've grown to like pumpkins, because that's all you'll be eating when I'm done with you. Dang, always r going for low blows. <laughs> I learned it from you. That's it, you're so dead. Take this! No, thank you. Behind you! Ugh! <laughs> you expletive! <laughs> How dare you! Whoa! <laughs> and that's it. That's it? Yep, I think that's it. And you know what? I think... I don't know if I should end it here, but I probably should. But if the credits roll up, I'll probably end it. Oh, yep. That's it. That's it for Let's Play Threads of Fate Mint Story. But it, considering it's the credits, and also I've been going on for quite a while, I think I shall end it here. So, I know, I'm just leaving it off the credits screen. You know what? Frickin' screw it, never mind. Pumpkins! In here we get to see all clips from the... From the game itself. And also, wow, this is going to be the longest video. And Elena, what are you doing? You know what? I might just split this up into two parts and... Hey, Rue. Oh, get back things. Lying around. And you know what? I definitely say... I will say that I actually did enjoy Threads of Fate and... Ugh. But except for Mel's 8 years mini games, someone said that was a con of this game. I would agree. The mini games in this game are freaking ridiculous. And hello, Gorton. <laughs> and I also will say that the characters were pretty funny. <laughs> Some of them were pretty funny. And also, I will say that Min's story really does contrast with Rue's story a lot. Because Rue's story was a little more... I don't know, a little more serious or whatnot. It, but with Mint's story, it was a lot more funny. <laughs> and I will miss saying expletive. I honestly will say, I did honestly find that bit funny. Because <laughs> it was just, uh... And I will, another thing I will say is that Mint's gameplay is really fun. Because of the how the fact is that you can just choose whatever magics and whatever effect you want. And, and I was honestly, I don't know, just like I said before, I just really enjoy magic. And there's the hoodlums that are on the loose. But I will say that some things about this game, like the controls, be, like the jumps being a little stiff was a little awkward at times. And of course, even though that I did make this game seem really easy, you can play this game for yourself. The reason I play these games is sort of more or less to just show them off and if you actually enjoy watching the games, you can play them yourself. And hey Rod, too bad I never got to actually fight Rod again. Wasn't able to fight Rod again. You'd know if you'd watched all of Rue's campaign or story. And also, there'd be less of that. I don't know. Also, Rod's uniform was kind of funny. That pumpkins! No! No! Not the pumpkins! Ah! Hell! Yeah, and just some of the things. Like honestly, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I'm just rambling. Sorry if I don't really collect. Be all that collective. But yeah, honestly, even though this game has some linearity, it is pretty fun. And also, yeah, like I said, even though I did make this game, I did make it look easy. I actually just, I'm just showing you the game, because if you want to play it, play it yourself, go right ahead. You can do it with less power-ups than I did. Heck, but I wouldn't suggest strength all too much to not be that low if you want to actually be able to get somewhere with the bosses. <laughs> Cause oh boy, if I had my, cause if I had my attacks low enough, it probably would have taken forever, and that's the reason why I also did. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's why I did have my stats up so high. 
And man, that was actually the highest I've ever gotten in my magic. 300. Damn. Wow, this is going to be so freaking long, this video. Yeah, this is probably going to be like an hour long. And get out of my face, Dollmaster! And I can't believe I said Dollmaster valid! <laughs> I have no idea where that came from. And there is the Dew Prism, which is the name of the Japanese version of the game. Yeah, it's so weird how... how some names in... when they're ported over have such different titles. It can be really... it can really throw you off. Oh... Uh, and yeah, I definitely think I will I'll probably upload this in two 30-minute parts. Maybe? Because, oh man, just... Ugh. Because the fact is that watching an hour-long video can be a lot. And also, this is, I believe, will be the hot, the longest video I've ever recorded. And also, this is by far the longest LP that I have possibly ever made. Even though it's only like six, about 64 parts, 65 if you count both the parts together. But yeah, this is honestly the most, the most time that I've spent on a single Let's Play ever. And also don't forget the fact is that this, it, considering it's a JRPG, it has a lot of talking and Square Electronic Arts. Ah, <laughs> good old Square. Or as they are all Square Enix or Square Enix, depending on how you say it, pronounce it. That's what they are nowadays. Honestly, just, honestly, really good fun romp. If you enjoy these kind of games. And Square of 1999 and Square 2000. Well. Come on, scroll faster. Need to end this off, please. And that's it for the credits. I guess I shall end it off here. However, there's something else that I'd like to show you, if it will show. End of Mint's story. Yep, that it is. The tale of a spunky girl has been finished. Come on. Is that it? Nope. Don't think so. Ooh! What is this? Yeah, you hear that sound. I knew it was the moment I saw him sleeping. I got this feeling that I would need your help, Rue. Oh! Hello! What is this? Hmm. What the? Huh? Okay. What is going on? So, you're Rue. You know me? I know everything about you. You and I are the same. We're both dolls of Valen. We are brothers, created for one reason. Are you going to resurrect Valen? Of course, that's what we are made for. That is our duty, it is our duty to resurrect him. It is the only reason for our existence. I don't think so. Why not? Because I have my own will which tells me I don't care about our duty. Forget about Valen and his orders. We were created to fulfill our duty. Without our duty, our lives have no meat has no meaning. Then look for a new meaning. Huh. Have you found one? Yeah. Do you think I can find one? I know you can. That's why I came. Hmm. Come on, let's go. Oh. Interesting. And yes, that is what Rue is. He's a doll of Valen. And I believe... 
Let's see, is there any more? If... Oh! Hello! Hear that music? There's more to this. Should be. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Back at East Heaven, I see. Notice this all leftovers? Hee hee hee. May is gone. It's time to party. Okay, what to eat? What to eat? I don't know. Hmm. I know. I'll just eat everything. Princess. Whoa. <laughs> what on earth is this? You just had lunch an hour ago. <laughs> Take it easy. I'm just having a little snack. You call this little? You call this a little snack? This is clearly a feast. Oh, come on. You can't just have one dish on the table. That'd be too lonely. Enough is enough. Your snack time is over. You have other business to attend to. We have guests waiting in the hall. They wish to see you right away. Forget it. I don't feel like seeing anyone right now. Tell them to wait. Go! Come on, Mint. We came a long way. That voice! No, it can't be! Oh! Hello! Haha! <laughs> Prima? Hi, Mint. Gee, you haven't changed one bit. You're as selfish as ever. Shut up! Ouch! So what's going on? How's Klaus and everyone doing? Everyone's doing great. Dad's still doing his research and Mom makes the best meals. Elena's still out there. How boring. Hey, did you come here on your own? Uh-uh. I got a ride. Hey, Mint. Rod? Long time no see. How you doing? Well, look at what we have here. You shouldn't have all... You shouldn't have. All this is for me. All this for me? Go ahead. Help yourself. Cool. Thanks. Hope you enjoy pumpkin. Prima, why don't you have some too? Yeah! I'm so hungry! You know, considering he's a doll, I'm surprised he does get hungry. Oh yeah! I forgot to give you this! Here! It's a letter! Ha! <laughs> From Dad! <laughs> I did it again! <laughs> I wonder what he wants. Hmm. Hmm? No way! Oh! Did he in fact find another relic? Oh, what's this? Oh! What in the world? Huh! It seems that Ru... Runus, someone's here. Oh, so I guess that's the name of the new doll. Who could it be? Whoa. I think I know. Rue, there you are! <laughs> hey, Mint. I thought it would be you. It's been a long time. I wish you'd told me you were coming. Just be quiet and listen. I just got incredible news. What is it? I got a letter from Klaus. Recently, he'd been so doing some research on some old manuscripts, and guess what? He found out that there are ancient ruins in the Western Desert. He thinks there's a relic there. Okay, Rue. You know why I'm here, right? You're coming with me to get the relic! Why me? Hey, I helped you get Claire back last time. Now it's your turn to help me. You owe me. So, Ru so Mint could have actually found a relic to help Rue get Claire back. Huh. Yes, I knew this day would come. I'm going to get the relic this time and rule the world. She still wants to rule the world? Ruins in the Western Desert. Must be the ruins of Epeliza City. That's right. How did you know? They're famous ruins. Valen conducted some of his experiments in Epeliza. Epeliza. Valen? Yeah, there's a good chance that some of his dolls are resting there. Dang! Valen! I'm definitely gonna need your help now! Klaus and his whole family already left for the desert. I think Belle and Duke are after the relic too. Gosh, everyone's going? 
Hmm. But what about Claire? Rue, it's your choice. I won't say n I won't say anything. Come on. What does your heart tell you? I want to see everyone again. Good. That's what I thought. You'll probably you're prob you'll probably be gone for a while, huh? I'm going to miss you, but I'm glad you're going. All right, let's get going. Come on, Rue, let's go. Wow. All right. Wow. <laughs> this is actually quite the long one. Oh. -ho. And they keep running. Well, off do they go to another adventure. Whoa. Huh. Well, seems that they actually had a... Gave a memorial for Dollmaster. And, well, off they go into a new adventure. Threads of Fate. The end. The secret ending, which you can only get if you play both Rue and Mint Story. That is why I also played them. <laughs> but, now it is finally... Do you want to save your game? With the save data, you can play a new game with powerful characters. Yes! <laughs> yeah, you can get a new game plus as well. <laughs> I'll just save here. And world domination, baby! <laughs> wow, i never seen that! To play a game with powerful characters, select to continue in the data... in the title screen and load this save file. Oh, well... You know what, actually, I'll... check it out if... what it's like. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, just return to the title screen. And yeah, you could just go through the game again. That's if you want to, but it probably isn't much point. And of course, this won't be it for now, because before I end it off, there's a few things I want to show you. And I actually have a few clips that I want to show you with Rue and Mint. Which, with Rue being that one area that I missed that I discovered with Mint, and of course Mint's magic. Let's go see what's behind this boulder, shall we? And, of course, the transformations that you'll need is, of course, Bubba from the Raging Mountain. And, of course, the Stinger, which you can get on the cliffside. Let's smash this and transform into the Stinger. What's in here? Huh? Oh! Bats! What the? Bats! Holy... Jesus, what the hell? What the hell's up with these bats? What are these like a... What the hell? Wow! Little bats! <laughs> wow, these things are annoying. I wonder how much these things are worth. Do I have any other tokens? I do have a mandola a stinger. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's... I wonder if these things are probably worth a fair chunk. But who knows. But... <laughs> yeah, that's essentially... That's all that's there that's in this little cave. So... On to the next clip, which of course is going to be all of Mint's spells, excluding gold magic and cosmos, because you have already seen those at the final boss fight. And of course, I'm going to show off every single color and effect. For white and normal, we have Vulcan, which is a rapid fire effect, which of course shoots balls of energy. Next, we have white and wide, which gives us spread, which is a five-way shot. Which is, of course, that, which is pretty useful for a bunch of enemies. 
Next, we have White Empower, which gives us Arrow, which is a Piercing Shock. Which, of course, will strike through multiple enemies. Next, we have Satellite, which is White Encircle, which gives us an Orbital Shot. When used, it will fire at an enemy within range, but, of course... It only goes so far. And of course, there is no super and hyper effect. Next, I shall show off blue and normal, which gives us droplets. And that's all it does. And of course, that is affected by gravity. Next, we have cutter, which is blue and wide, which gives us triple blades. Similar to, it's similar to spread, but it does slashing damage instead of light damage, and of course, it takes a little longer. Next, we have Ripple, which gives us that. <laughs> and here we have Crystal, which is blue in circle, which leaves pretty much a mine to hit your enemies with. And of course, here we have blue and super, which gives us Icicle, which is not that great. Next, we have Restore. And the way that this spell works is that if you actually take damage, you can actually use this to heal. Right there. And of course, whatever magic, whatever MP is left over is used because it has a base MP cost of 100. Now on to the next one. Which, of course, is red magic. For red and normal, we get burner, which gives us flames, and... It's a short-ranged flamethrower attack, but... It's alright, and of course, I pretty much assume that it would be a... I don't think it's affected by gravity, but it... Who knows? I don't really pay too much attention. whoop de doo And here we have red and wide, which gives us bullet, which is a low flame attack. Which, essentially... Yes, leaves a flame field which which stays over time. And here we have Red Empower, which gives us Flare. And of course, when fired, it launches a slow-moving fireball, which can of course hit multiple, which can hit big targets multiple times. Next, we have Delta, which is Red in Circle, which sends out a wave of flames. Then next we have Napalm, which is red and super, which sends out a cone of fire. And here we have Fireheart with red and hyper, which gives us a fire coat. And of course, it does that. It essentially gives you a shroud of flame, which will damage enemies that you come into contact with. Next up, we have Green and Normal, which gives us Wave, which is a wind attack. Which is actually relatively useful and powerful. And next we have Green and Wide, which gives us Typhoon, which is a whirlwind. Which is another cone attack. And for a Green and Power, we have Gale, which is a low wind, which... Does that end? Of course, it would be affected by gravity, I would assume, because the fact is, it's a low attack. Here we have Green and Circle, which gives us Cyclone, which is High Wind. And... that's all it does. Yeah, it essentially just hits enemies that are higher up. Next, we have Green and Super, which gives us Impulse, which is a Circle attack. It's a Nova effect, essentially. And here, we have Green and Hyper, which gives us Nightingale, which renders us invincible for a short time. See? No effect. Relatively useful. And of course you can easily get your MP back up since you can just attack and of course regain MP. Next up we have yellow magic and of course with normal we get spark which chases enemies. So even if they're off center they will they will get hurt because it, of course, chases them down. Next, we have Yellow and Wide, which gives us Cracker, which is a double shot. Which is that. Next, we have Yellow and Power, which gives us Bolt, which, of course, strikes them with, with lightning from above. And 
With yellow and circle, we of course have force. Which, of course, <laughs> works similar to fire coat. But, of course, it's not that... It doesn't last that long. And next we have trine, which is yellow and super. Which, of course, is similar to spark. But, of course, it's three of them. And here we have yellow and super, or yellow and hyper, excuse me, which gives us final flash. Which does... Whoa! That's actually pretty cool. Yeah, it's just another Nova effect. <laughs> and finally, we have Black Magic. And with Normal, we of course get Bomb. Which, fired, does that. And of course, can be used to destroy rocks. Next, we have Black and White, which gives us Dark Mist. Which, when fired, does that. Conflagration of Black Smoke of Death. And next, with Black and Power, we have Graviton, which shoots forth a black ball that will, of course, will also destroy rocks. And with Black and Circle, we have Drill, which fired, does that. And of course, it actually travels farther if you hold down the triangle button. Next, for Black and Super, we have Dynamite! Which, of course, does that. And, of course, for the final one, which is Black and Hyper, we get Shadow Strike, which gives us a deadly dash. And, of course, that is actually the third. There's actually three spells that actually have the death element? I have no idea what that skull symbol means, but that's... Yeah, that's actually the third one. And, of course, all it does is that. Ow, thank you. And it's not very effective. It's not very impressive, I will admit. And, of course, that is all the spells that Mint has that, of course, isn't gold. And, of course, we already know what that is already. Anyways, that shall conclude it. That shall be it for this clip. Ugh, rambling on, as usual. Of course, that... And, of course, yeah, the reason I show them is because I didn't want to leave everything out because... I kind of want to show off as much as I can. And also, if I sit on the title screen long enough, something should show, which is right here. Which didn't show the first time around. Yep, this is in fact the opening, or this should have been the opening for the game. But, it's a good thing that it didn't show because it did, this does have spoilers. Yeah, this honestly... I actually do remember this opening from the demo, and this is honestly pretty cool. Yeah, it's just look at that. And see, it, it would have spoiled characters and whatnot, but... <laughs> but it's actually a, as much as an appropriate time to show them, to show this now that the game is actually finished. And, oh yeah. Well, you know, it's... Also, that is a lie! You never ever get to do that with Rue! You never get to fly up the sky! And you- neither do you get to go to East Heaven. And also- but at least you get to see some interesting things that never actually happens in the game. And... Here we have one final look at the cast for one last time. Yeah, I don't know if there is a continuation to Threads of Fate. Probably isn't, but if there is, I'll probably try and find it. But, of course, that shall be it from me. I've been the Northern Star Dragon. This has been Let's Play Threads of Fate, and I shall see you in the next LP, whatever it may be.